According to a recent study published in the National Bureau of Economic Research, healthy people make around 28% more money over their lifetime than those who are not healthy. In today's world, success is more important than ever. Many people lose sight of their health in their pursuit of wealth. They don't realize how their poor lifestyle choices affect their financial stability until it's too late. In this article, we'll explore the complex relationship between your health and your wealth. We'll look at the financial implications of unhealthy living, so you can make wise decisions that put your health first and create a prosperous future. When we speak of health, it encompasses not only physical well-being but also mental and emotional wellness. Neglecting any aspect of our health can have profound consequences, reaching far beyond our physical condition. Let's explore the various ways in which unhealthy living can wreak havoc on our finances. Unhealthy living often leads to chronic illnesses such as obesity, diabetes, heart disease, and hypertension, among others. The financial toll of managing these conditions can be staggering. With rising healthcare costs, medical expenses can quickly eat into your savings, leaving you financially vulnerable. According to a report by the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, CDC, chronic diseases account for 90% of the nation's healthcare expenditures. The importance of taking care of your health early on becomes evident when you consider the long term financial burden of managing chronic illnesses. Illnesses not only impact individuals personally but also have a significant effect on their professional lives. When you're constantly battling poor health, your productivity at work can suffer. Frequent sick days, reduced concentration, and lack of energy can hinder your career progression, ultimately affecting your income potential. Moreover, chronic conditions often require ongoing medical appointments and treatments further detracting from your time and ability to excel in your chosen field. Unhealthy lifestyle choices often result in higher insurance premiums. Insurers take into account various risk factors when determining premium rates, including age, pre-existing conditions, and overall health. Individuals with poor health are perceived as having higher risks, leading to increased premiums for health, life, and disability insurance policies. This additional financial burden can be a heavy blow to your budget, leaving less room for savings and investment opportunities. The impact of unhealthy living extends beyond the immediate financial consequences. Poor health can force individuals into early retirement, cutting short their earning potential and diminishing their overall wealth accumulation. Additionally, Chronic conditions may limit your ability to pursue certain career paths or take advantage of lucrative opportunities. By neglecting your health, you risk not only your physical well-being but also your financial freedom and future prospects. In order to achieve the recommended sleep of 7 to 9 hours per night, the first step is to establish an earlier bedtime. Additionally, it is important to adhere to appropriate sleep hygiene measures, such as hanging room darkening window treatments, adjusting the thermostat to approximately 65 degrees, and abstaining from using electronic devices, such as a smartphone, prior to bed. If 9 hours is too much to ask, it is recommended to look for windows in the day to take a brief power nap. According to a Harvard study, napping can have a positive effect on memory and cognitive functioning, which may provide the necessary boost to become more alert at work and make more informed financial decisions. Planning your meals ahead of time is a good idea for both your nutrition and your finances. Even if you only plan to eat out a few times a week, it's still a good idea to avoid making the habit of stopping at a restaurant for a meal instead of eating at home. Feel free to cut corners if it means it'll motivate you to stick to your healthy eating habits. For example, instead of relying on empty calories to fill your stomach, try adding more energy-packed foods like almonds or blueberries to your diet. This will help you stay focused on your financial goals. Don't miss out on the health benefits of regular exercise. Aim to get in at least 2 hours of exercise a week, 
and if you're feeling a bit lazy, make it more fun by adding more physical activity to your day, like biking to work or watching TV while you work out. The bottom line is that if you stick to healthy habits, you'll start to see the benefits. Regular exercise gives your brain more energy, which helps with your cognitive abilities and memory, so if you're not getting enough exercise, it could mean you're doing worse at work than your more active colleagues. Reducing stress can seem like a big job, but even small steps can make a big difference. Start by figuring out what causes stress and how you respond to it. Then focus on doing things instead of buying things. Stress can also affect your wallet. Just like stress eating, stress spending can also occur. Even though it's often called retail therapy, this type of emotional spending can lead to more issues than solutions. So whenever you need to unwind, grab a good book, chat with a friend, or take a jog. It's not just stress that causes overspending. Sadness, too, has been shown to cause overspending, and the financial consequences can be just as severe. Of course, having access to doctors, mental health care, and medications is one part of the solution, but there are also practical ways to avoid depression and lower your financial burden. It's important to understand the complex relationship between health and wealth in order to make wise decisions that focus on both. Poor health can lead to costly medical bills, reduced productivity, higher insurance costs, and fewer opportunities to build wealth. When you invest in your health, you're not only protecting your physical health, but you're also investing in your financial future. Remember, investing in your health is investing in your wealth.